nothing too dangerous, she said. Nothing too dangerous. I'm doing it too dangerous. Uh, is this dangerous? No. This definitely doesn't look too dangerous at all. Taking a nice seat by the ocean, fantastic, easy. So guys, how are you getting on? Probably better than me, hopefully. Uh, as you probably know, I'm uh, convalescing. Um, with my little uh, incident <laughs> so uh, I thought it'd be a uh, perfect time the mind is okay it's just the body that's uh, uh, out of action a little bit at the moment but um, so I thought it was a perfect time to uh, maybe catch up on a couple of videos that uh, I've been probably postponing for a little while uh, one of them is the update on this total call fridge freezer that we had and we had it uh, when did we have this we had it for the winter trip in Scotland uh, we had it uh, we've been using it throughout the summer we did that a month away in the summer and uh, I've been asked what is our best product that we bought this year and this is probably the product that's top of that list uh, basically a lot of the time um, as you guys know we're normally on campsites and stuff like that so we don't really suffer with the power problem as regards like power stations and stuff like that too much but uh, this for our kind of trip has been the most useful bit of kit of, of of the whole the whole time this whole year this is the perfect thing uh, so this is the 55 litre fridge they do the 35 we'll put some um, the links in uh, for the uh, if anybody wants to get one of these things um, basically um, they do the uh, 35 the 45 and the 55 this is the big one the reason we went for the big one because so we can compress loads of food into it it goes down to minus 20 um, and everything's been you know so we, we've had sacks of ice in there uh, on our summer trip we had a quiche that had been in this thing the whole time and on our last night we took a frozen quiche out and cooked it um, and that's how valuable this has been a lot like uh, and all them lovely bits of food that you know that we like to eat um, our beautiful chicken from MS frozen down in there them sort of things um, obviously on the way if you do and me with my chip hit um, on the way with the chips and stuff you can always pick them up to replace um, but we've had so much we just and it just saves you that shopping time like I said before I don't want to like literally go on my holiday and spend loads of time in a supermarket so this is uh, one of them reasons why it's been so invaluable it, this one here has got the uh, obviously I'm not that active at the moment uh, but it's got the uh, the big basket in the in, in it so you can take it out um, it's got the extra fridge area that you can put extra milk in and cheese if you want to um, and a lot of people are going to say like basically Joff you know why aren't you using your freezer in your motorhome we do but it's a little tiny square box uh, anybody with a motorhome knows how small that box is and once you get a sack of ice in there uh, it's pretty uh, there's there's not much room for much else really so uh, this is where we stack it all up in the boxes all them beautiful burgers and our bits and pieces that we love to eat in here and uh, there it is so uh, I'm going to uh, carry on convalescing guys and um, yeah, don't think there's anything more to say on this one. Uh, this is number one piece of kit for this year for us. So uh, yeah, that is it. I'll, um, I'm going to just sail away into the sunset and uh, 
enjoy my convalescing moments. <laughs> I don't, hopefully it's not going to last too long. I need to uh, get back out there. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. You know the score. Um, link's going to be in the description. And uh, any other information, just give us a message. And uh, we'll try and tag in some uh, information as well. Thanks for watching. Catch you soon.